Hi guys, this is Vojtjemenda from Thyroid and Metabolism and I just wanted to make a quick video about uh, feeding chickens flax seeds and what it does. Uh, in Europe, um, flax seed is, is called linen seed and it's, it's often recommended as an omega-3 supplement. So that's a quote from, uh, from a book called Commercial Shell Poultry Nutrition, 3rd edition. So, from the chapter about flaxseed. Quote, when laying hands, there might be transitionary problems with suddenly incorporating 8 to 10% flaxseed in the diet, usually manifested as reduced feed intake and or wet sticky manure. These problems can usually be overcome by gradual introduction of flaxseed using for example 4% for one week followed by 6% for another week and then the final 8-10% inclusion. It usually takes about 15-20 to 20 days in order for omega-3 content of eggs to plateau at a desired level of 300 mg per, per egg. And that's that's uh, end of quote. And that's uh, the part that's the most interesting to me, and it shows um, what a prolonged feeding with, with flaxseed does to the chicken. Quote to do the chickens. Quote: With prolonged feeding, there is often greater incidence of liver hemorrhage in layers, even though mortality is rarely affected. Such a hemorrhaging occurs even in the presence of 100 to 250 international human units of vitamin E per kilogram of diet, which is a regular addition to flax-based flax diet. Disturption to liver functions might become problematic if other stress occur. End of quote. So that's that's a kind of like interesting information from them you know again this is book for farmers who who raise chickens and and who wants to produce uh, omega-3 enriched eggs so it, it shows that basically that omega-3 thing especially from flaxseed is not that good for chickens and just to let you know that um, 8 to 10 percent um, of flaxseed in a diet means that uh, there's about one point that about one to one point five percent of total calories, which is extremely extremely small quantity of the the, the general diet of the chicken comes from alpha linoleic uh, acid. So it's just you know really really tiny amount that cause such a significant problems in chickens. Okay, thank you for listening.